I'm Andrew Renucci, standing at Palm Beach in Sydney, Australia, where Home and Away is filmed. And I'd like to welcome you to the Mendip Cycling Vlog. So hello, welcome back to another video. We've got a special video today. We've been invited to do the Somerset Glorious Gravel. So we've got nine kilometers of beach to ride. We're going over Crooks Peak and Cheddar Gorge. The weather's not the greatest so far, but it hopefully will, the sun will come out again. But we've got 100 kilometers of gravel to look forward to. And uh, <laughs> this is only my second time on a gravel bike. I've got Pete and Mark Taylor with me. So hopefully we're all gonna have a laugh. Hello. Hello. Excited? Sorry, we're just chatting. <laughs> Very excited. And how good does the trek look with tan wall gravel tires on? Hoo, hoo, hoo. What's it saying? What, all, uh, all the gear, no idea. All the gear, no idea. Yeah, it looks good so far until I fall off, which happened the last time we went on a gravel ride in the Quantox, didn't it, Pete? I actually haven't seen you ride it yet. You walked it down the steps, you walked across the grass. Are you going to ride we, today? We did cycle up from your house. <laughs> and here's the man. Hey, Darren, you all right? How are you, Mark? All right? Good, thank you, yeah. Thanks for inviting us. That's all right, looking forward to this. I'm very excited for this. Hey, hey. Yeah, until I, I fall off. Happened, I don't know what's happened to the weather, though, after yesterday. No, well hopefully the sun will come out a bit later. Yeah, fingers crossed. Fingers crossed, yeah. And just like that, we're off leaving my old school. <laughs> it's been a few years since I came here, that's for certain. Can you hear my heartbeat? I've just realised where we're heading. We're going up Stone Down Lane, which is hard to walk up. I've been walking up here with my wife lately. Now I'm going to take a bike up there. <laughs> I said that was hard enough walking up, let alone cycling up. Bloody hell. <laughs> That's a nice little warm up. Is that a sign of things to come? <laughs> it's all flat to burn them. fast up there, right at the top. <laughs> oh. Well, at least we're at the base of the tour. Right, so we've reached sector three, and this one's probably a three out of five. Uh oh, and I probably shouldn't be doing it one handed. I'll take a chance. I heard something yesterday. It said, look pro, but go slow. <laughs> That's exactly what happened down there. We looked good, and then we got dropped. <laughs> I got completely spat out the back, but um, that I said that was three out of five stars, but very quickly turned into five out of five. Yeah, that <laughs> and first bit before the bridge was quite hard. I, I was struggling to get even get the camera out and film, but yeah. He you came, you, just, into his own on you just dropped us for nothing then, Mark. This is when the full sus comes into play, fine. We've got more to come in a minute on the drove. You, you we go left and come, we go back down the other side now. Yeah. He, he was worried this morning that we were going to drop him. <laughs> <laughs> that was a bloody good start, wasn't it? Yeah. This is good, this is. <laughs> right, so that was sector four. Uh, that was quite hard. Uh, I don't know quite how I'm going to get the camera out on all these gravel bits, but it was so much fun, I was laughing my head off. <laughs> I'm such a great time already. <laughs> but I am such a noob. I have no idea what I'm doing. I'm bouncing around everywhere and I've worked out that my actual number is 643 so added together is 13 so that's unlucky for me isn't it? So fingers crossed I stay upright. You were asking back there what gear should I be in? I, I have no I idea. Have absolutely no idea. Should, uh, should you be in a big it. gear? Should you be spinning? I have no idea. But anyway whatever I'm doing is wrong because we got absolutely spat by that group of orange guys. <laughs> Next one. Oh, it's just a bit too late to be on camera. Oh, yes. <laughs> Can you make sure you do it again on camera? But then I'm not surprised because that ain't gravel. <laughs> yeah, that's going to be me next. <laughs> they're walking. Now, they're all convinced that this road was the route. And I, I thought, according to my GPS, it's the next one over. But if it's the route, then that, that ain't gravel. <laughs> do you like this next trench? <laughs> You gonna ride through that? I'll go for it, yeah. No right. right. <laughs> <laughs> no chance. There is no way that was the correct route. Yeah, it was. Look at everyone's come through there. Didn't you? Didn't you go for the drive through? To, with a couple of craters, the car wash. <laughs> <laughs> oh look! Lo and behold, the actual route is probably proper gravel. Yeah, that's where we should have come out and gone straight across. <laughs> hey. I'd like to say all, all these sectors are five out of five because I am bloody rubbish on them. <laughs> but it's just like our normal club rides, isn't it? It's quite hard, aren't they? <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
so exhausted. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know what hurts more? My arms. My Your arms, arms are hurting from like bouncing oh, around. They're definitely bouncing. I think there's some horses well, that, coming. That, that was definitely easy in the last sector, which we shouldn't have been on. Yeah, that wasn't best signposting, was it? <laughs> well, no, there was no signpost because the turning was the next one. <laughs> oh. oh, well, it's an adventure, isn't it? Yeah. If we don't go off route with you, then is it really a <laughs> mended right? <laughs> Mark's already in burden. <laughs> <laughs> he's absolutely flying. He's, he's got the right bike. I think it all came back When I was looking back at you Oh, how I've missed those sights You must have missed mine too did you breathe me in? If you would only know that you're in my air. That last sector was the best. Yeah. That Is was it nice. smooth and we did yeah. fast? It was uh, awesome, that was. Even over to Mark. Thank you. They're not very technical, so <laughs> yeah. we're quite good at that. That for us noobs. For every second, everywhere I go. So Are you boys enjoying it so far? Oh, really good. Take the bumpy bit. You haven't fallen off yet? Oh, one of you fell off, didn't they? Oh, yeah, in front of me. Yeah, we've all done that. And found a phone. I found a phone as well. Yeah. So Having a legendary day. Looking oh, forward to the beach? Yeah. We're looking forward to the beach. Yeah. yeah. Sun, not, sun tan. Yeah, not far now. Ice cream. Ice cream, yeah. yeah really. And a Coke. Day, <laughs> That's what we're looking forward to. Uh, we haven't fallen off yet. Does that mean we're not trying hard enough? <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> what? What it means, Pete, is we're going too slow. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Right, so quick refreshments, and now we're off to the beach. This is the bit we're looking forward to. <laughs> we know it'll be smooth. We hide in these crowded places. Cause when our eyes meet, we drop our poker faces. Yeah, we keep on acting like. Hey, Pete, we're back in Burnham. It's becoming a habit. Are you sunbathing, Pete? No. Yeah. That was literally the minute I stopped filming, put my camera in because they were shouting at the top, watch that first corner. <laughs> Stacked it. <laughs> Come on, one more, let me actually film it this time. <laughs> I'm going to walk the next bit. <laughs> no, go on, get on. Go on, do it again. <laughs> Go on, go on. Hey! I know where we can go. And it's all you and me. We'll kiss the sky goodnight. Go faster, go faster. <laughs> yeah, how much fun, but how hard is this? <laughs> it's so much fun with that. I'm out of breath. <laughs> You just kept, you gotta just kept try and find the hard stuff all the time. You got lovely sand in your helmet. Yeah, it's probably because I fell off twice. <laughs> <laughs> just run away with my darling. We'll get real lost. We'll get real lost again. Just run away with my darling. Pressure, pressure, pressure. Chicken. You thought that was gonna be the easiest bit? I thought that was going to be the easiest bit. That was so hard. <laughs> so tiring as well because you just got to keep spinning. My bike's slipping all over yeah. the place. This is your first gravel experience. <laughs> oh, no, you're on YouTube. <laughs> Are you enjoying it? Yes, it's very hard. But <laughs> so is the beach better than the non-gravel? Actually, I preferred that than the gravel. You did? For sure, yeah, yeah, yeah. None of you came a cropper? Well, at the beginning. I came off, you came off the button, and you got a little stump. Oh, thank God. He <laughs> <laughs> just lying on his back in a trench, it was hilarious. <laughs> Come on, Pete, you can ride this bit. I thought we were coming for a bike ride, not a walk. <laughs> All right, so that's the beach park done. We're now on the bike track from Breen to Uphill. So a bit more gravel, a bit more, a bit more stuff I can go with. Easy gravel didn't last long, Pete. <laughs> We're back to one of these.
Take out a slur, everyone. Get away. My heart is on fire. Trouble is, that's all the flat bit done, though. Well, it would have been clean again. Every video. <laughs> it's only up from here, isn't it? Mm. Three big peaks. The profile's like, mm -mm, flat. <laughs> I'm also taking confidence there's still loads of food left, so we're not the last ones on the course. Mm. We're expecting a few more people Right, so this is the second food stop. Uh, we're going up Canada Coom next. We've got the three big peaks. So who knows what that's going to be like off road. How do you boys find that? Because that was several notches above my level of technical ability. <laughs> it's tough, isn't it? <laughs> Just, oh, right, I don't know where Pete's gone, but we're going to see if we can go find him. But Crook's Peak is next. So this is the bit I've been dreading because I know this is going to be hard. But judging by everything so far, it's been harder than I thought it's going to be. <laughs> God only knows. This might be the easiest. Coming down Canada Coombe was difficult. And we got this path, but we got to go up there. <laughs> no, we don't want to go up there. Should we do it? Yes. Yeah. So the route said a thousand, just short of a thousand meters of climbing, didn't it? Nine hundred and eight. We've not even done five hundred. Really? So the the remainder's in the last bit. <laughs> Put that. Put that. <laughs> Mark's gonna do it. Not the time to leave a break, or not. It seemed like a good idea yesterday. <laughs> How hard was that? Did you make it all the way up or did the right bit get you as well? I, I caught the guys in front and then I, I, couldn't, I couldn't get past them and I nearly fell over again. <laughs> yeah, I, I had to get off because the, the ladies got stuck behind Mark and uh, she cut me up and I had to clip out quick and I couldn't get back going again. We've got to go up to Wavering Down up there now. I'm not looking forward to coming down, to be honest. <laughs> no, I went through the trees at the bottom there. That was really nice, really fast. Yeah. And then it just went like that. Yeah. <laughs> Take me home tonight. We Oh, what a great spot to bring a bike. Yeah. Do you like that, ladies? It's worth coming up for, isn't it? <laughs> I think it all came back When I was looking back at you Oh, how I've missed those sights You must have missed mine too Did you breathe me in? Hey, Pete. Is that all the climbing done there? I actually think it is. This is it. Gradual uh, little road. There is, don't you? Up to pretty. pretty, and then off road downhill. Then down all the way home for a beer. So this ride has been one of the most fun rides I've ever done, but it's also one of the hardest. I think it was billed as one of the UK's hardest hundreds. Really? It definitely is. That was a much needed refreshment stop. I think we now have one sector left that takes us to the top of Wells, then drop us down, and then it's beer o'clock, thankfully. Where I go, so why are we hiding in these crowded places? Cause when our eyes meet, we drop our poker faces. Yeah, we keep on acting like we left them. Thank you very much, Mark, you're a legend. I thought that was really good. Ask who fell off, out of the three of us, who fell off on the beach. 
yeah, it's right. <laughs> <laughs> the guy on the um, at the end of the feed stop said he thought at least 50% of the people fell off on the beach at least once. I think if you try and change line too quick, yeah, yeah. I, I can get any traction. It, it's it was one of the hardest bits, considering the bit we were looking forward to as being the easiest bit. <laughs> But no, that's a great event, Mark. You enjoyed it. Yeah, ab Brilliant. absolutely loved it. Yeah, it's it's one of the most fun things I've done on a bike, but probably one of the hardest. Excellent. Yeah. Well, heck, you'll see you what's, what's your next event? We've got uh, next weekend. We've got a road event from London to Brighton and back. Oh, nice. Yeah. And you got a Salisbury gravel one? Salisbury gravel in August. Yeah. Oh. In July, sorry. In July. Nice. Yeah. yeah. Well, good luck with that. All right. I mean, we've got to sink it. Alright, so I'm absolutely done. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and we will see you soon in the next video. I have no idea when that'll be. I'm going to take some recovering from this one, but such fun. Uh, get on the Glorious Gravel website, have a look at their events, and we will see you very, very soon. This state of my legs. <laughs>